What is up, you guys? It is your boy Jad here from Puma Plot. Welcome back to another Farming Simulator 19. Of course, guys, we are here on Lakeland Vale by Stevie. How y'all doing? And welcome, welcome in. Getting ready for the weekend, boys. I don't really have anything going on. Oh, I went to the wrong side. What a noob. What a noob. All right, so I did stream this map yesterday. That video will hopefully be out Saturday on the second channel. Links in the description. So, you know, go check it out if you want. I would appreciate it. But during that stream, I was actually asking, I was like, hey, what should we plant? And it was corn. And then I decided to plant the big field in wheat. So as you can tell, the corn's all gone. The wheat is still here. That part's not grown, but whatever. Not a big deal. I didn't know that. The grass, I did the grass again as well. So we obviously we needed corn heads, you know, to, to harvest corn. So we, we do have corn in storage. Uh, the reason I chose wheat is we are basically out of wheat in our storage. So I figured, hey, why not? Let's get some, uh, get some wheat coming in. I do kind of feel like I need to ask you guys, um, what else on this map? What else? Not that I, I'm not bored. I just... You know, we've been playing a long time. We've been playing a long time. We have money. We're going to go ahead and right now and just buy everything else on the map because we can. I'm just going to go ahead and buy it all. I was thinking about doing this today on stream and then, or yesterday for you guys. And I was like, you know what? No, I'm going to save it for a video, a video, a video. Um, so yeah, what else? We have cows, we have pigs. You know, do you want more animals? What do you guys want? Ooh, that was pricey. Oh wait, that wasn't pricey. Never mind. I was looking at the wrong dollar amount. I was looking at more money, which is dwindling rapidly, but that's okay. That is okay. All right, so we are now poor. <laughs> uh, we could borrow a loan. We we are now down to four hundred forty-one thousand dollars. Um, I have purchased a couple of tractors today as well. We will get to that in a minute. I purchased another cultivator. Yeah, lots of stuff. So basically I'm not a hundred percent like ready for a new map, but like I, we need to start thinking about this, you know, we need to start thinking about possibly a new map here soon. What, what else do you guys want to see from this map? Um, cause you know, coming up in about a month here in November, I will not be doing day streams anymore. Okay. So, you know, we got to keep that in mind too. I won't have as much, I won't have anywhere near as much time to, to work on this map. So actually that would be a good thing to start a new map <laughs> because I won't have as much time to work on a map. And, uh, that's actually going to be a good, a good thing to start a new map because basically you know, when I start a new map, pretty much everything I do is on video or recording. I should say what, however you want to look at it. So that might actually be the strat <laughs> is to go ahead and start a new map roughly around the time when, uh, when I need to start working on Christmas lights pretty aggressively. So like I said, not ready for a new one right this second, but, but sooner rather than later. So I guess. First question I have for you guys, don't tell me what map. Don't do not do that yet. But what I will ask is, uh, what else do you guys want to see from this map? Obviously, we can, like, you know, harvest the world. Okay, that's that's fine, you know. I'm okay with that. I am going to continue to stream this map next week, probably Tuesday and Thursday both. Uh, we'll see. Which, you know, if we want to if we want to take on the world, then that might be the way as far as, like, actually planting everything. I guess if that's the case, what do you guys want to see a map harvest of? Make it a grain crop, not a potato sugar beet, nothing like that. What do you guys want to see the entire map harvested in? Um, that's a good question for you guys to answer as well. But besides the harvesting everything on the map, what else do you guys want to see? I, I need to, I honestly need to know. Because uh, I'm curious. I'm curious what you guys uh, would think and have to say and... All that good stuff you know what i'm saying you guys are kind of running the show here and uh yeah i think it'd be a really good thing to uh, get your guys input as always right 
As always, speaking of input from last video, a couple of you guys said, you know, just feeding them silage and stuff, the uh, cows. And then I kind of, I don't want to say I got called out, but like I kind of got challenged, you know? He, he's saying that like, saying that like, you know, even the console guys can make mixed rations, you know? Well, okay. <laughs> Bet. By the way, you notice I have three combines set up on this. Let's handle that and then we'll get to the, to the mixing thing. So I've got the tribine sitting up here, guys. I'm going to purchase a head for the tribine so it matches up with our other combines that we already have. Makes sense, right? So $75,000, I think it's worth it. So now we can run all three combines in one field because we have the same head on the tribine as we do on the other two combines. So, I think it'll work. Now, obviously, if I'm going to go harvest somewhere else with the trap mine by itself, then yeah, I'd probably, uh, probably just use its regular head. But for this, this will, this will work for what I want it to do, you know? All right. So, now we need to steal. And we'll make this the right combine. Okay. Let's go. We're going to let the first guy get ahead a little bit, and then we'll start the next guy and let him get ahead and start this guy. And then I need to run auger wagon like a madman. <laughs> uh, that would be the goal, right? Actually, you know what? We, we might, well, we could harvest this field different, like divide it up in sections and just hire combines regular instead of uh, horse play. I don't think I'm going to be able to get this done before I have to turn off or not turn off but like quit the game i might i don't know i don't know normally i render this on the gaming computer which doesn't like to render and play a game obviously at the same time so maybe we'll uh render it on the stream pc tonight i don't know we'll see we shall see okay you need to be unloaded already all right this is gonna go well i should have started the drive by first right Okay, I don't even have an auger wagon out here or anything yet. I don't have trailers. I, I don't have. I just don't have it ready. Um, quick side note. I bought the um, 98 or 8970. Sorry, 8970. Dyslexic sometimes. Triples. Altivator. Boom. Bought that today. We're going to let the combines just go do their thing for a second here. We need to get a, we need to get a wagon out there. Now, there might be something in here new or two. Or more i don't i don't know you guys know about the fent i bought this john deere this is the 8r t the 410 this is from the sid uh the sid john deere 8r or john deere john deere american tractor but whatever it is great tractor love it i love it the skinny the skinny track stuck up underneath there i don't know why i just really like that you guys knew about the channel or the uh Kloss. i think you guys knew about the Kloss already and the and I'm just going to say chat's a really bad influence on me. I needed a tractor to uh, Ted Ted with. I was going to Ted field nine and I needed a tractor. So I, this is the only articulated tractor in the game. I didn't have. So the T nine, uh, five, six, five on triples. Of course, that'll probably end up on a cultivator just because that's a good cultivator tractor, you know? So there's that. All right, we are going to run the Fent 1050. Okay, we're going to run the old Fent 1050 here with only 4.5 hours on her. Really haven't used it for much, but we are going to run her on the auger wagon because the Fent 1050 has speed. The Fent has all the speed, boys. It goes 39 miles an hour. And it should handle this trailer fairly well. I mean, 8Rs handle this trailer just fine. Oh, and you guys don't know about this, I don't think. Do you? Can't remember if you guys know about this or not. No, I just did this last night. You guys don't know about this. I found this mixing uh, site thing, mixing station. Um, so the cows, now I have fast time some. but And yeah, they need to be cleaned and stuff. That's the big, uh, they need to be cleaned and stuff. But I have fed them. EMR. 
So probably going to run some more TMR. Actually, ran course play to fill that. I did make another batch of silage as well. I, I was, said I was going to use a fermented silo for that, but I actually don't mind packing it down and stuff in there because I, well, I use course play. Let's be real. So not a big deal. Not a big deal. And it gave me something to do on stream. So like I said, I streamed this map yesterday. It's today for me, yesterday for you guys for uh, about five hours. And uh, that video is rendered. I got to run it through my other program and then it, it should be up Saturday. Okay, it should make it Saturday is what I'm hoping. So, yeah. I uh, I don't think I'm going to have a Transport Fever Let's Play this, uh, again this week. I don't know if I want to just kind of forgo that series or, or what I want to do there. I enjoy that game, but at the same time, I don't know. I feel like I ruined it by putting it into sandbox mode like ever. And I, I probably should not have done that where I can just cheat for money because it's like there's no challenge. But at the same time, that game takes a really, really long time if you don't cheat for money. So it's kind of a, I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of like this map even. It's, you know, when I had enough money, that everything's cultivated. Everything is cultivated in the whole rest of the map. What's up with that? Uh, but like once I had enough money to buy, like, you know, I can just go buy a Jadir 8RT or buy a new Holland T9 and not even think about it. That's when it's like, okay, okay, what should we do next? You know, and actually if we go into tractors, large tractors, and we scroll over to anything articulated, we have the T9, we have the Challenger, the MT900E. We have, we don't have this quad track, but we do have a quad track. We do have the John Deere part of the Borgo DLC. This isn't articulated, but still kind of counts. Um, we don't have this 9R. We don't have the 9RX. But that's okay. Actually, no, yeah, we don't have those. We do have the 8970, uh, which is an awesome, awesome tractor. We don't have that. I, I've got a lot of modded tractors that I don't necessarily run, but... Yeah, so I mean, we've got like all the tractors. And it just becomes that point where it's like, I can just do what I want and it doesn't matter what I do anymore. So I don't know, it kind of, it kind of gets to that point where it's not as much fun, you know? All right, let's uh, fire up the old tribine as well. Actually, I feel like this head's gonna work out well in this thing. I did try it before, not in a field. I just like, you know, Fired it up and I, uh, you know, I did the dad thing of tat, tat. Oh man, I actually did that yesterday in real life. I, uh, tightened a ratchet strap and I said, that ain't going nowhere. I actually said that. I did it. I legitimately did that yesterday. <laughs> Why is this only going six though? There we go. Okay. So this is rolling now means we need to uh, get back over here and keep stuff empty actually but first let me take a selfie let me get something out here with a tipper on it just so I have uh, some kind of capacity at the field uh, probably should set this up on course play yeah. but that's okay We're, we'll, we'll get the big trailer out here we'll be okay for a little bit we will be okay this tractor I like the... it's a little whip whip but if you're actually running stuff and you're say on GPS, especially do you guys know multiplayer, we run GPS a lot. Or if you were using a wheel or a controller, it'd probably be better. But since I'm on a keyboard, it does get a little whip whip, but it's not terrible. You know, it's not terrible at all. I really actually like it. So yeah, not, not the fastest tracks in the world, obviously on, on tracks, but really good i'm just saying you guys you guys know i talk about larson farms a lot can you just imagine this tractor with a tow behind sprayer on track this tractor with a big planter you know it'd be like a uh, old chat just saying all right that's not what i want i want the fan and 50. let's go Let's go. So yeah, you guys need to let me know in the comments, like what to plant, 
and I guess that'll be for the whole map, okay? That'll be for the whole map. We'll just we'll just do a map harvest, and then we'll see where we go after that. I mean, I'm to the point now. I'm, I I could make a bunch of money off the pigs if I needed to. Um, I could sell pigs. In fact, I need to. We're way over a thousand now. Since you know, big fields take a while. Cough cough the grass field, and uh, you know it ends up being nighttime, so I fast time, and all the pigs just keep over there, just doing their thing, you know. So. I don't want to say it's unfortunate, but, you know, it is what it is, right? Okay, that other combine needs me already, but we got to get this guy empty. Otherwise, he won't make it very far, and Tribine's going to come run him over. Ah, uh, the joys of a grain cart driver, right? <laughs> Everything is my fault. Even if it's not, everything's the grain cart's fault, right? Just saying, because here comes the Tribine marching around the corner back there. Three combines, it, it's probably going to get chaotic out here, and I probably will end up gapping them out more. But I feel like i got to get this outside round done. That's probably what I should do. Start them fairly close-ish. About like I got this to the drive mine. Start them fairly close-ish, and then once they do with the outside round, then go ahead and turn them loose uh, one at a time. Give them a couple minutes head start. But at the same time, you want them close enough together because emptying is a thing. Because, yeah... And I tried course play, guys. I did. Maybe it was a tractor thing. I don't know. But I did try course play. And every time I tried it, it went to the, it would basically try to break the game. So actually, hey, while we're we'll try we'll try setting up a, a little course here uh, with course play. Like I've said, next map, I want to scale back my mods. I would like to use course play and I would actually like to use auto drive or auto driver auto auto drive. I would also like to use auto drive as well. I think that would be kind of a neat thing to use, you know? It would be interesting. So I want to find a map. And like I said before, I'm not looking for a new map yet. Uh, I'm still all in for Lakeland Vale, you know? But soon, it, it will be soon. And actually, I think right or right, probably before, before October's over, we'll be changing maps, guys. Uh, still going to do three days a week. Still going to do... Uh, the new style of recording where I record, you know, basically in real time for you guys. It's just so much better. All right, that come I need. All right, so I'm just doing a little little uh, temporary thing here. Basically, what would happen is every time it would go to actually drive on the course play, well, the other combine just gets, just snuck ahead. Well, he'll be stopping in a minute, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Uh, every time it would actually go to drive on the course, the game would want to, like, crash. So, okay, of course, now this tractor's going to be fine, right? Maybe it was the... I was using, uh... I was using the in-game 8R, wasn't I? No, I was using the 8R, 8RX. Yeah, so what it would do, it was really weird. Like, the tractor would just drive away from the camera. It was... It was strange, man. It was strange. All right, I'm going to see if I can do this to see if I can get that combine to jump past. There we go. See? That's professional farming, boys. That's how the millennial farmer does it, right? No. <laughs> I'm kidding. I actually don't. Don't get it twisted. I do like Zach. I, I like the millennial farmer. I'm just playing. It's, it's a farm sim thing. You know, I have to do it sometimes, right? I mean, I could have gotten out and stopped and all that, but what fun is that, guys? What fun is that? So I might actually set up a secondary cart here. I might set up this cart because I know it works on course play and then go run another one. Because I feel like we're going to need two to keep up with these with these combines. It'll get better once they're going back and forth. And like that tribine's only at 15% back there. But like, you know, he's good to go. His capacity is massive. It's stupid, honestly. How much capacity he has compared to these combines. I feel like I'm just going to ride around with these guys basically all the way around the field. Good thing I'm only 52%, huh? I'll get them as far as I can, and I need to focus more on this combine. Actually, it really doesn't matter, but... Yeah. What is in the map back there that just made that do that? Nothing. Okay. Like, is there a stump under the map I can't see or something? Like, what? Wagon's got hops over here, boys. 
remember these John Deere's they unload super slow so high yielding crops probably not the strat here you know uh, for the record I have sold all my hay equipment as well tether windrower both mowers tether windrower both mowers uh, I finally sold the baler and the bale stacker that I've had for absolutely ever and haven't touched uh, today while I was streaming it's probably because I had like six things going on course play but I was starting to get fair amount of whole what I'll call homestead leg uh, dropping frames in the homestead I was only able to maintain 25 to 30 frames honestly so it was getting pretty heavy there in the old homestead uh, so it was time to uh, liquidate a few things of equipment I probably do need to scale but turn back my tractor collection as well because it's, it's getting out of hand now uh, with with mine all these random tractors <laughs> while I'm streaming so you yeah, know probably need to work on that a little bit but that's okay right it'll be okay so good barely gonna get this guy to pipe out in time here we go now i'm at 66 <laughs> percent oh goodness i just need a uh, another auger wagon would be good yeah i've been wanting to get auger wagon working on course play for a long time let me tell you, I've been wanting this to work for a long time. And actually today, uh, after stream, but before I recorded this video, because I let this map run after I streamed, um, I picked up all the grass with this version of course play as well, which was crashing last time. Now, last time I think I, I was using a modded tractor. I was using that pace, uh, the quad track that's modded. Today I used the in-game uh, Kloss, the big Kloss tractor is what I actually used. And it worked flawlessly the whole time. So maybe there's something to some of these modded tractors. Of course, but they don't like each other, you know? Uh, sometimes it's hard to figure out what's going on, you know? I don't they'll go digging in the log pile. I know somebody's going to say, oh, go in the log pile. Yeah, I don't. I usually don't mess with that, you know? I'm just saying. All right. Of course, you're going to put your, you're going to be full by trees. All right. Well, I think there's just the one here. So, yeah, I have some room here. Come on. Come on, come on, put your pipe out, sir. Unload here. Let's go. Meanwhile, tribine's at 22%. Why didn't I just buy a second tribine? <laughs> Two tribines would almost harvest this field. Nah, I mean, it wouldn't, but it'd get really far. That's for sure. It'd get really far. I know that last, when I did soybeans, I had put the tribine in one to four or four to one whatever that field six and five before i emptied it and it was only like 66 percent full <laughs> even with corn it did like two fields and it was only 60 70 percent full but whatever it was but yeah this is this is yeah i know it's a great combine it's just it's a little too floppy for me you know i've talked about that before it's too like puppy dog doesn't know where his feet are kind of floppy all right we're gonna let him go there We'll get this oh man that that try buying is he going faster no he's going 12 he's just rolling maybe boy he's rolling just pitter pattering you know just straight up pitter pattern all right i'm definitely gonna have to empty and i am going to set this up on course play because i want to not because i need to because i want to and plus then i'll buy another auger wagon We'll buy this same wagon which is the um uh, this one right here the mod you know what we can run a coolamin i like my coolamins guys uh let's grab the big coolamin why not it's actually a bigger bin now uh, let's run the uh, medium coolamin it's the same size bin let's run that why not it's only seventy seven thousand dollars and we'll put it on uh maybe the 8rx or something because I'll run that one myself. You know what I'm saying? I will run that myself. But first, let me take a selfie here. I wish I could tell it where I want the pipe, but I don't think it'll do that. If it does, I'm not sure how to do that on course play. Because I think it'll just go where it wants to. Go where it wants to. Roam around the world. Okay. 
Because getting this to work with that trailer, I know, is going to be a trick. But I thought I could tell it in here. That'd be like in the loader stuff, wouldn't it? Probably. It'd probably be in the loader stuff. Alright, let's try it anyway. Let's try it anyway. That or we'll just get our semi out here and try to run run to that. If it would stop, okay, right there is fine. If it'll, uh, I think I put a pause point in. It's been so long since I've done this. It has been so long since I've done this. And we'll drive away. And I feel like that's all the course I need, right? Let him, let him rip. Fader chip. Okay, uh, I need to sit here and watch this though. The first, the first go around. So we'll drive it back to the start point just to. Well, they're cutting through already. Holy cow. Okay. Didn't pay attention on the map how it was going to cut, honestly. Oh, yeah. All right. Please work. Please work. If this works, then I'll, of course, play that uh, tractor as well. Okay. Not quite where I wanted it to stop, but it is working. Okay, and I probably should, of course, play the tipper tractor first, but okay, it is okay. Uh, where's the where's the tractor I want? The night R D R X. Where is that? What was I using that for last? Was it in the? Oh, it is in the shed. Okay. All right. I didn't think it was. Now, I know I'm, I'm losing some speed here, but by having two of us running, it should be, uh, it should be okay. Should be better anyway. This, I just, I really like running this tractor. Not going to lie. It's a really good tractor. Really, it's so unique. Now, I don't like the tracks on it. I will say that much. Leonard, uh, Leonard made me buy that. That last, uh, one day I was streaming this. One day I was streaming this, he made me buy it. He put a gun to my head and everything, guys. Not really, but yeah. Try buying is gonna pass both of those combines, by the way. <laughs> Which I expected, it's fine. Oh, you know what? I actually didn't tell I didn't tell this guy to go to any combines. Uh we want him to go to both John Deers if possible. Thanks for playing, Bud Dro. Hopefully he'll go do his thing. Now that both combines need to be unloaded. I am, my frames are tanking right now. Auger wagons on horse blade tanking frames, maybe? Or is it this tractor? Uh, get more. Yeah, is it this tractor? When I look at this tractor, okay, you know what? Is that the problem? I had heard something about that when this tractor originally came out, that it hurt frames. You know, I got a few things going on on the map, plus throw this tractor in there. That could be the issue. That, or, that auger wagon getting, getting moving on course play for the first time. That's probably what it is more than anything. Because we use this one for multiplayer. I don't really have see an issue with it, honestly. So It was probably... The auger wagon that's not moving, maybe? He is moving. Okay. Probably need to turn his speed up. You want to see some real speed? The tri bind. <laughs> Look how fast he is. Yeah, I need to turn his speed up. He's going way too slow. I uh, don't really want to empty this guy right now, though, because if I do, then it cause problems. Let's go to you. 1050 and. You're 12 miles an hour. I don't see that anywhere here, so. Turn that up. Turn it up some. Once we get this running, if we can keep these combines moving, we should be in good shape. This stopping like this is going to cause. Is going to cause issues, of course. Now, if I empty this guy, he's just going to go run into that one, you know? I kind of don't want to do that. That combine is emptying up there, though. Should go ahead to try mine. Try mine gets too full. It's not good. Try mine full is not a good thing. I'm just saying. Plus, we're, we're gapping combines out, and I'm okay with that, you know? Yes, I'm driving in the crop. Kind of sometimes you just have to. It's unfortunate. 
mean, not in real life, obviously. You wouldn't do this, but... Hey, it's Farm Sim, guys. <laughs> Did you know that? And just like that, that thing's empty. That, that thing unloads at an insane pace, guys. Absolutely insanity. Unlike these John Deere's. John Deere's don't unload. Can he pipe out to me? No. Yeah, that'd be cool if he would. Alright, so we're going to let that be for a second. We're going to get this concourse play up here, too. Boy, this thing is dogging this tractor. Holy cow. Need one of my big articulated tractors, right? <laughs> one of my many big articulated tractors that we have. Yeah, so when that wagon starts to move, that is dog and frames. That's what it is. That wagon starts to move around and it's just killing my frame rate. As I'm sure you guys can tell. Alright. Go off to storage. Actually, this is going to be big food, basically. Should we, should we do that? Should we have them dip in here and try to give it to the pigs first? <laughs> I'm assuming that's what's killing my frames. Because, like, that thing was moving earlier and it was killing frames. And it's moving now and it's killing frames. So, And now it's better. So it must have, like, did what it was doing, you know? Let's be honest. Course plays pretty hard on farm sim sometimes, you know? Horse play can be very, very intense on uh, farms sometimes, for sure. So, yeah, it is what it is. This is already 51% of this trailer. Wow. Trailer holds the world after all, so. Great. And I will move my silage eventually as well. Probably not going to go ahead and do a third run. I just don't see myself using it, you know. I, I did a lot, and then I just like, eh, I'm good. I don't need it. <laughs> so and dump not actually gonna dump though don't worry need to get back to the field I got a combine full another combine filling up already <laughs> that other John Deere's already 40% oh my god he just emptied him and he's 40 oh he's emptying the other guy now hot dang go course play worker go man I don't know what's up to that spot in the field. It must have just been too late in the day. We'll just not worry about it. Go course play guy, though. Am I right? Holy cow. He actually found his way back to the other combine. Wow. Man, there's potential here, right? <laughs> By the way, next the next map, which I know I've, I've, I don't, I'm not ready for names yet or anything like that. So don't, don't do that yet. But I will say. Uh, 4X is probably not out of the question. Because, you know, PC upgrades, and I, I, I think I feel like I can handle a 4X map very well these days. Uh, as well as Farm Sim can, that is. Okay, so 4X map is not out of the question. And, um, yeah, hopefully that's okay. 4X map's not out of the question. I would like to have the option, obviously, to use course play. And auto drive those are my my two things so i, I would want a map that auto drives already mapped for because i don't want to go through and map at all I, I want something that's already mapped up you know anyway there we go with that leg again then it's better oh course play guy course play guy don't hit him dude you're like bitter pattern over here bud just saying now we got two of us running we're gonna knock this out i was gonna end the video but like hey you guys want to see some real harvest? You guys are buckle up, buttercups. We're here. We're real harvest now. This is a harvest operation if I've ever seen it. Okay. He's going to come here and try to empty this guy, but I'm, I'm here, so I got it. Just saying. Now, if I could just get him to, like, nuzzle up. Nuzzle up? Wow. If I could get him to come up next to me and offload me, that would be sick. Is that possible? I don't think it is. <laughs> Like, hey, Buttercup, come here. Hey, you guys. He's going to, oh, he's going, see, he realized this combine's not full enough. He, he moved on. Tribine's done already over here? All right. All right. That's awesome. Go ahead and unload, bro. 
Oh, see, now he's coming back. He, he moved on. Now he's coming back. Okay, though. This is good. Really, I could just kind of go sit and watch and wait till he gets full. Just saying. These John Deere's unload so slow that, you know. All right, we're going to let him go. Turn and burn, baby. Turn and burn. The tribine's just like, hey, I'm out of here, deuces, y'all. Y'all have fun over there now, you hear? I'm just going to take his grain every time. <laughs> I mean, we have 250,000, uh, 100, yeah, 150,000 bushel of grain cards, which, or whatever they are. Whatever it is, yeah. I don't know. It comes out to something else in bushel, I guess. 150,000 liter grain carts. Let's go to fill this thing up and see what we get, actually. <laughs> that auger wagon's like, hey, what are you doing, bro? <laughs> Give me my grain. That other combine obviously is not filling right now because uh, he's an ungrown prop. In real life, I guess he'd pull the head up and just kind of, you know, or go around it, actually. Go around, let's be real. Look at this, pitter patter. I love the Kuhlman bin too, by the way, and I'm glad I didn't go with the big one because that's just too big. It's just a little too big. Tribine's doing his thing. I want to go empty him. I'm trying to fill this cart. It'll take a while though, but that's okay. Once they get over here and get on uh, some longer rounds, they'll really be pounding it out. But like I said, I was going to end the video, but you know what? Why not just keep it rolling, you know? Okay. How much longer? You have 32 minutes left on your, okay. We're not going to finish the harvest in the video tonight, okay, or today, whatever. But we are just going to pitter-patter here for a little bit. I want to I want to see that uh, the uh, auger wagon, like, empty himself, you know. We should probably leave the two deers alone. I don't have him set to run to the tribine. I just have him set to run to the deers. So actually, I could say, like, have one run to one deer and one run to the other deer if I wanted to. Or just tell him to run to all three. Which would be kind of cool, too, you know. That would actually be kind of neat. One's at 50, one's at 33% over there. This tribine's only at 9%. But he's got like half as much as the other combines do. So. Yeah. Kind of with, oh yeah, he's going to go skip way over, isn't he? That's right. But hey, at least he knows where he's going. And course play victory. Victory royale for your course play tonight, chat. Not chat. Comment. You guys. You wins. Y'all plus three. You know who you are. Appreciate you guys watching. Especially if you're still watching this far in the video. Holy cow. Thanks for that. Thanks for that. All right, you're empty. You're dead to me. Not really. That was a little harsh. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to fill up this wagon, you know? Like 3,000 bushel? Not quite. No, not, not 3,000 bushel. It's going to be a bunch of... I could do math, but I don't want to. <laughs> It's, it's one o'clock in the morning and I'm not doing that. Okay. Just saying. I'm just saying. But like, I want to see him empty, but if I fill up, I can go empty into him. You know what I'm saying? So like, we're going to yoink some grain here out of this combine. Not sure which one. I think this is the 33 percenter. It's either the 33 or the 50 percent. I'm not sure. I think 33. This tank doesn't look very full. Wait, are you turning, bud? You're gonna turn this way? Okay. Uh, okay. I'll get out of your way. Look at that pirouette, man. He did it. He nailed it. Actually, rather good turn, too, actually. Horse plays getting smarter every day, boys. Just saying, it really is, honestly. That other way? No. The other way. Not here. Another combine should be in route momentarily, though. Hey, yeah. Pretty awesome. This is what I've wanting, been wanting to accomplish for a while. Running, you know, and actually it's really cool. Three combines, two carts, a tipper run, and all on course play. You know, I could probably run this cart on course play. Maybe not with this tractor. Like I said, I think I was having issues with this tractor. Uh, wanting to crash the game and actually here I'll show you if it's gonna do it. I'll, I'll show you here We'll grab the course from the 1050 Let's save the game I know it did an auto save and I'm gonna do a manual save 
save the game just in case it does crash. And then see, this is what it does. It's just going to drive away from everything's still running. All I had to do to fix it is cancel. But look at my mini map. Everything disappears on the mini map. Obviously, it's not good. It's something with this tractor. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw it out there. So that's why I yeah, haven't done this till today because I've been trying to use this tractor and it hasn't been working. So now I know the 1050 works. The 1050 probably just got a new uh, new job for the rest of this map, you know? I'm just saying, probably a new job for the rest of the map. 1050, let's go. And I, I can unload you, but you know, you can, you can wait too. You're gonna do a, wait, where's that combine going? Is that combine going rogue right now? I think it might be. Where, you're going rogue. You're so going rogue right now. You are so going rogue. Yeah, I, when the game, when the game did its thing, this combine decided just to take off. Guarantee it. Okay, so we know where this guy just went up, right next to where that, that combine is. So I have to kind of go put him back over there and see if that, uh, if it helps, you know? That's totally what the combine was just heading out to left field. Or, yeah, left field. One of the fields, right? Actually, I'm not sure here where he should be. He's on the left of this combine is where he came from. So we'll put him back over here and tell him to go to his nearest waypoint. We'll just tell him to go from nearest right here. And he should be good to go. Okay. Back to our 8RX. Oh, I thought they were going to collide up there. Holy cow. Gonna go steal me grain out of that combine though. Gotta go put the blocker, the one two on him, you know? Block him. <laughs> That'll take me a while to get this longer wagon full. Although, like I said, now they're in like longer, not longer rows, but more consistent rows. Oh, we'll get her done. Get her done. As he's gonna drive behind me trying to. How's it going, bud? <laughs> It seems like their awareness of other stuff in the field is a lot better uh, these days, you know? That's what it really seems like. It seems like horseplay's awareness is a lot better. They've kind of smartened it up a little bit more than it was, you know? It's really what it seems like. So, yeah. Alrighty. We are, uh, we are doing it, boys. We are doing it. Okay, get out of your way. You're going to need to turn around and your other combines on your six, which is fine. What's going on here? Yeah, we know you're just going to sit there, bro. You're fine. That was the wrong thing. All right. I said all the awareness is better and that auger wagon's literally being pushed by that combine. <laughs> You're going to fix yourself, okay? I was going to come move you. You're doing it, though, bud. He's still trying to get to that other combine. <laughs> that's what he's... I think that's what he's trying to do still. He's trying to get up to the other combine. And he just can't do it. He's so disappointed in his life. He's rethinking all his life choices. All the life choices. Am I not going to fill this auger wagon like ever or what? The goal is to fill this thing, okay? I'm just saying, I'll go to the storage and fill it. Jeez. Have to be something besides wheat, because I don't have any. But yeah. <laughs> I literally have like no wheat in storage. He's still driving. <laughs> but actually, I'm, I'm kind of surprised. I could have basically kept up with just myself. As long as my tipper was on course play, because, you know, I need somewhere for the grain to go in a timely fashion, you know? But uh, this is not bad. Of course, it never having to empty the tribine uh, kind of helps too. Or not as often having to empty the tribine, right? Because it's just pitter patter and doing its own thing over there, you know? Just doing it, boys. Just doing it. Fight me. Getting pretty full there, buddy. 70. Oof. Good, good, good. 
not like too close to you or nothing. Come on. They like just bitter batter all of a sudden out of nowhere. It's like, nope, nope, nope. Okay, go. <laughs> He's still trying to get here. <laughs> Feels bad. <laughs> Feels bad, bro. That's probably why this auger or this combine's trying to like stop and slow down and stuff. And maybe I just steal him and empty him into me too. We're over three thousand bushel already. Just saying, this, this would be a massive like if this was real. Oof. I'm assuming that card is. I don't actually know. I assume they are. Okay, now you're causing problems, bud. Stop. Type out. Causing problems. Probleming. Man. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Easy. Oh, I hear a train. Man, I don't hear him that loud very often. Holy cow. That thing's like screaming loud. All right, that other card's full now. So we can tell this guy to go. Go, go figure out your life, bud. You gonna go figure out his life or what? Do you not go? Maybe you're just gonna wait until I come. I need you probably. That's what it is. That's fine. 4,256.8. The point eight is what makes it for me, okay? <laughs> By the way, I don't live that close to a train track, but man, that train was that or it was like a truck going down a highway with a train horn, not a truck horn. That's for sure. I'm not, I'm not really sure, but holy cow, look at how much of this field we've knocked out boys. I know this video is getting a little long, uh, but Hey, uh, you know, bonus content. <laughs> so I think what I'm going to do to be completely honest while I'm er editing this video and off like that watching the finale of love island because i haven't watched it yet uh i'm gonna let course play just do its thing here you know i'm gonna kind of park off to the side of the field with this tractor and, and auger wagon and i'm gonna let course play do its thing figure out its life and hopefully it'll all run and work and i'm very interested to see how it all kind of do its thing you know all right so we'll just go park over here to the side and uh be out of everybody's way so next time guys i'll be back on this map um let me know what you like i said earlier let me know what you guys want to see planted over the entire map i guess i guess we'll uh we'll go for a map harvest so let me know um you're full buddy where's your where's your auger wagon where's your auger wagon it says that he's coming, but like he's not. He's not. Are you set to go to those still? Yes, you are. Okay, maybe we have to. Uh, let's just go. Let's go make him run his little course, and then he should be fine. Any hoozles? Um, I'm gonna go ahead and shut it down. Shut down the video for you guys. Get it into the old editing program now that it's like way long. And uh, uh, hopefully it'll be uploaded in time for you guys. Like I said the other day, they, they kind of, I don't know. I don't, why won't you go from here? What? Why won't, there you go. Um, I kind of, you know, they've, they've kind of fixed up the internet a little bit. So hopefully uh, everything's good there. Okay. We need to increase your speed though, my guy. You've got to go faster than 12. Okay, 14, you got to go faster than 14, my guy. Why are we only going 14, my guy? We've got to go faster than 14. Everything's set. Everything's set higher than 14, my guy. we got to go faster than 14. 39 works a lot better, buddy. Uh, both combines are full. <laughs> He'll figure out his life. Anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. Let me know what you guys want to see planted in the map. And uh, that might, you know, take a little bit, little bit to accomplish. Probably going to have to buy a second seating rig. Uh, but please do keep it some kind of uh, something we can use, say, these combines on. You know what I'm saying? Maybe not like a potato sugar beet. 
nothing like that okay anyway thank you guys so much for watching have a great rest of your day and as always a toodles